because of some product that we've seen. The way the proposal was written was very clearly defined and straightforward and gave us a clear understanding of the product that we would get from them and the tangibles that we would be able to take away from it. Of Janus Economics, Robert Pittman were also fond of. However, the experience that um, we've received probably over the last couple of months as things haven't been returned to us in a timely manner, but we would like to have seen. Um, so that would, that would be our only comment. Market Street has been extremely timely and um, very, I mean, receptive to our, uh, our needs. I'd like to go ahead and get this process started. If it's any way possible that the board feels um, that they could vote on this tonight so that we can get started with this in April. Um, we have massaged this strategic plan for the last how many years? Oh, three, I think. Yeah, I don't. Yeah. Does anyone feel that we need to massage it anymore? Um, we've gotten estimates, we've gotten proposals, you know, we've had the community survey done. We've carried this down to a uh, target identification analysis. We've got three proposals before us. Um, I think they may have been emailed to every member of the board prior to this meeting. Does anyone see the necessity of you know, perusing over this any further? I just have a couple of questions. Yeah, we want to answer all your questions, but I, I just want to go ahead and get this dealt with so we can move forward. Go ahead. That's good. In terms of the experience and the breadth of knowledge of these three, the least um, Market Street, do they have as much experience in doing this as the other two? They actually have more. more. They have more. They, they, been, they started in 1997. Whereas Janus Economics started in 2004, and Georgia Tech Enterprise Innovation Institute, maybe 15, 10, 15, so about the same. Probably Market Street and Georgia Tech about the same. Yeah. But it really looks to me like the, uh, the Georgia Tech um, proposal has got big holes in it. Mm -hmm. and, and that's a problem for me. Well, I well, think, you know, from a target market study, when we go out and we talk to these target markets, we really, they're going to ask us for the workforce data to ma that matches up to their target market. And um, that's going to give us that data. Um, and that's what's going to give us the data. Apologize. Just because someone's a good market research target industry kind of consultant, I don't know if that necessarily makes them a good website or something. I'm a little concerned that they might not be who I would pick at all to just look at our website if this problem had come up six months from now. Um, so I don't know that what I know about Market Street would say they know that much about websites. I think you also have to be careful that if you get over the $50,000 mark here, we have an issue there. Yeah. I think we should separate the two of those, and I really think we need to stop and think whether or not this is who we would use for website design completely agree with you and so um, it's listed as an add-on in the proposal and it's not something that we have to move forward with and doing right now so this is just something that was in the proposal on the last page you'll see where it says next steps and that was just one of their suggestions I added it in because of the situation we're having right now but we don't have to move forward with that at all I mean maybe they have tons of experience in website design but so I'd like to see okay. that sure absolutely I was so, talking to our Pete, sorry, for the, for the new website design and all, we would go for a sort of a industrial authority specific designer. Yeah, yeah, I think they're just making through. recommendations from a site consultant economic development perspective. They're not actually recommendation on the, the um, design of it. They're saying this is the critical data you need to have in order like let's take a look at what you currently have up is it adequate is it accurate and is it taking care of the right target that's what they're looking at they're not looking at the design or anything like that they're just offering their expertise in economic development to help direct us in what's right so uh, we but we don't have to do it but we don't we can keep that separate and that does not affect these proposals in terms of no. the cost no so I, ms good my understanding is that you'd like to just 
separate from Market Street any notion that they are going to provide us some consultation with regard to our website. Yes, correct. The time being. Okay. Sure. Any other comments? That's, that's a good. That's a good thought. That is a good thought. So, Ms. Gooden, given that you had this great thought about this, I'll solicit the motion. <laughs> I move that we accept the staff recommendation and move forward with Market Street. Second. Second. We have a motion to second any further discussion. I assume you've done reference research yes. on and I have examples that. of product if you'd like to see some of their product. They have some case study stuff in that. Yeah, you, you yeah we've done, yes. Okay. Uh -huh. Any further discussion? Questions? Call all in favor. It's unanimous. 